I just remember my mom and my grandmother when I was younger, they would just always, like if they were cooking hamburgers or like a steak, um, they would always just give me a piece. Guys, it's not every day that a video I cover makes me feel physically ill, but every now and then I think it's a good change of pace to go from my normal videos, which essentially boil down to a variation of people making poor choices, to looking at videos that kinda just make you want to throw up. And today, we have a crossover. Not only is today's video gonna make you want to throw up, you're gonna want to throw up because of somebody's poor choices. Meet Wendy, a woman who only eats raw meat. Now, people eating nothing but raw meat is nothing new, but generally, when you decide to make a lifestyle change like that, you, you know, kind of do some research. And, well, you can probably see where I'm going with this, Wendy has done what seems like zero. It's not like she's eating steak tartare or food that is meant to be eaten raw. She just goes to the grocery store, buys any meat, and then eats it. Why she does this? I don't really know. Let's find out. Please subscribe. Hi, I'm Wendy Marshall and I enjoy eating raw meat. In other cultures, um, it's their everyday life, like that's what they do. They have a big variety of meats, insects, but here in America, when I do it, people find it odd, weird, people come at me. All right, 15 seconds in and we already have a terrible reasoning for doing this. Yeah, okay, people eat raw meat around the world, but it's usually prepared in a way that is safe. You know, part of an actual dish. Not just walking into Walmart, grabbing a filet mignon and shoving it down your gullet. That's like saying people drink alcohol alcohol all around the world, but they get mad at me when I drink hand sanitizer. We're at the grocery store and I'm gonna come in here and get some lunch. Okay, so I'm really not joking when I say I think I've been to this exact same Publix. And if it's the one I'm thinking of, it's in Florida, which, you know, pretty much explains away any sort of question I might have had during this video. I started eating raw meat. I suppose I was like two years old. It could have been before that. I just remember my mom and my grandmother when I was younger, they would just always, like if they were cooking hamburgers or like a steak, um, they would always just give me a piece and it just became the normal. Um. I'm, I'm sorry, but did this woman just say that at two years old, her mom and grandmother were feeding her raw hamburger meat? Yeah, that's not a dietary choice, that's child abuse. It was always just normal for me. I invited my grandmother over for dinner, so she's here for dinner, and dig in. I didn't realize that other people didn't do that. Yeah, this is honestly kind of starting to make me feel sick. Ground beef is probably the worst kind of raw beef you could choose to eat. It does not have the same kind of food safety standards as something like a normal steak, because generally you cook it more. How are these people still alive? Until I would say I got into like middle school, high school, um, and I would do it around my friends and they were just completely weirded out to the point where they would scream and run. So good. I agree. I still enjoy it and I will do it for the rest of my life. Yeah, um, you probably will. I have a feeling that the fact that you eat nothing but raw meat and the rest of your life are probably connected. Okay, so this beef, you see how it, it's kind of like a, a lightish pink. I personally wouldn't pick anything like this because it, it has a different taste when it's a little bit more lighter than as opposed to this. This is darker therefore you'll have more of like the iron steak bloody taste i can't really explain it <laughs> um so i would get something like this i mean as a person whose favorite food is probably steak cooked steak that is i might be a little bit biased but there is just no possibility that a raw steak that tastes like blood and iron tastes anywhere near better than a good cooked steak i will just never believe that looks like my burgers are done just the way I like it. When I'm eating raw meat, it doesn't disgust me. Um, I don't find it gross. 
I find it actually kind of like empowering, like dominant. What? You find eating raw meat empowering? Are you a caveman? I mean, that honestly sounds like some cannibalistic serial killer stuff right there. I mean, I would honestly not be surprised if at some point Jeffrey Dahmer said that eating meat makes me feel powerful. Uh, me and 13 absolutely enjoy it. And um, it makes me feel more empowered and more barbaric in a sense. Yeah, anybody who craves something that makes them feel barbaric should probably be locked up. I do crave the iron taste, the bloody taste, the texture. If you love that, there's you can't get over that taste. Like, it is amazing. It's absolutely amazing, and you will forever crave that. The meat by the bone, oh my god. I've been eating raw meat since I was two years old. Um, I don't do it for any health reasons or anything like that, although I do have a hard time digesting cooked meat, so raw meat is a better benefit for me. Yeah, that's not because of the way you were born. It's because your body has actively had to devolve over the course of your life to handle your diet. Maybe a few hundred thousand years ago we were, but humans are no longer designed to digest raw meat. I also am a part of the keto diet, so, you know, if you are a part of the keto diet, then you know that meat is a big thing in the ketogenic diet. Also, there is vitamin B in raw meat. It's good for reproductive health. Um, it's good for your digestive health. People are really concerned about how my stools are. Um, and there's, there has not been a change. They have been normal. They have been perfectly fine. I am not pooping out worms. <laughs> I mean, honestly, I'm not really surprised by that. Like, she said she's been fed raw meat since she was two, so eventually your body is gonna adapt. I still think we might need to get CPS on this situation. I mean, I'm no lawyer, but feeding raw meat to a two-year-old has gotta be a crime. Also, people want to know how my lady bits are. They're perfectly fine. Me eating raw meat does not change the way that they are, if anything. You know, um, raw meat has benefits with your hormonal stuff and things like that, so I just wanted to clear the air on that. Everything is good for me. So, I mean, she might really be fine. It's not impossible that she's just gotten lucky and hasn't run into any issues yet, but this is not the norm. I mean, you probably can't even count the amount of times raw meat has been proven to, in fact, not be beneficial for you. It's just another one of these dietary trends that people are falling for instead of just, you know, eating healthy. Our brains are pretty complex, and the fact that a normal human brain tells you not to eat raw raw meat is a pretty important sign to listen to. And so a lot of people, when they see something that they don't understand, they tend to act negative towards it. Like they shun it or they're, they come at you in a negative way because they don't understand. And honestly, it's kind of why I'm making this video, um, to try to help people understand that there's so many health benefits to what I do, and it's not just some girl being stupid on the internet eating raw beef. Um, no, that is quite the opposite reason people act negatively when they see you eat raw meat, actually. People react negatively because they do understand it, and they know it's not normal, and it's bad for you. Stop making this out like you're some sort of victim. There is a reason this is not popular to do. Now, the rest of the video really just seems to be her not understanding that the reason that she can eat raw meat is because her parents have made her do it her entire life. It's like she really doesn't know if the average person just ate an entire raw steak, they would become incredibly sick. Well guys, how you feeling? If you were eating while watching this video, well then I apologize. Honestly, this video made me feel a bit queasy. The steak was fine, I eat my steak pretty rare anyway, so it didn't really bother me. But watching her eat the ground beef raw? My god. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it it's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.